Hello and welcome to the 360 of Opera 2020 award ceremony. I'm Avi Green, your host, and thank you so much for being here and thank you so much for voting. This year has been a extremely difficult year for the opera industry and the opera community, but we are here to celebrate the amazing, innovative, and creative things that have been happening. And seriously, there are some amazing things happening. We could not cover everything, but I implore you to please send me, Avi Green, right there, um, or 360 of Opera, more of your favorite moments of 2020, of the people who've been doing amazing things, because we would love to emphasize and amplify as many people as possible. It, it, it's the easiest way to spread what's out there. So with that being said, I would like to say cut me off there and supported the industry in ways big or small if it was buying a ticket to an online virtual event or if it was sharing a virtual opera performance or even just watching opera streamed on YouTube it has made so much of a difference and thank you to all those people who are making sure that we get to have that entertainment at home as for that thank you to all of our nominees for being so incredible and so hard to choose from and I cannot wait to see what else you get to keep from this year or what we're going to toss and just try new but thank you so much for everyone who voted and for all of the exciting 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 things ahead but before we get kicking off with the rest i would like to say thank you to my co-host phil he's very silent but he means well and he had some and for the final time here are the categories once again No one said that being an independent, innovative opera company was easy, but with that being said, this year's group really outshone, outshined the rest. Um, and please make sure not only to check out the one, the winner, but check out the other nominees and make sure you go and support them and what they do because everyone has, like really, everyone has been incredible this year. But here are the nominees once again. And the winner for Best Independent Opera Company is, oh, this is so exciting. This is many dreams coming true right now. Whoop. Bear Opera. What has been amazing in 2020 is being able to also share not only into productions, but also into the gala events of many of the great opera houses around the world and some uh, private individual ones. This year's gala um, winner is, I will tell you in a second, but first, here are the nominees. And the award goes to, the award for best gala goes to, Jesse Norman at 75 by Black Opera Film. This year was a great time to stream music on your phone or um, on some kind of stereo if you have that at home, if you're lucky enough. But uh, with that being said, many new albums came out this year and we've been listening to things at home way more than we have in a while. So the best albums that came out in 2020, it's hard to pick. So here are the nominees for best album. And the award for best album of 2020. This is a lot of fun. Now I get why people, um, I don't know. Is that why they do it? I don't know. I really enjoy this stuff. Mm. Satisfaction of ripping. Okay, I'll do it now, I promise. Eileen Perez, Mi Corazon. I definitely could use a co-host. This would be a lot um, better if I had someone to um, talk to. He's not very helpful. But <laughs> on to the most innovative production of 2020. This was an extremely hard category. People have really thought outside the box and come up with some incredible productions, whether it was the actual new operas and librettos that were made or taking old operas that we love and cherish so much and putting a completely new spin on them it is been it has been beautiful to watch but with that being said i want to make sure we give 
credit to all of those productions. So here, once again, are the nominees. And the award goes to... Swashy tape, shouldn't be that hard. Vegas City Opera, The Ring Cycle. Collaborations are what keep our industry going. It really keeps it kicking because it's impossible to do opera just one person. I mean, have you tried? It's not easy. Um, even just the training that goes into making us singers sound amazing takes a lot more than just us. So, first of all, thank you to all the amazing collaborations out there, whether they are on the stage, off the stage, or if, to, or if it is to empower those on stage while this year has been so difficult. Thank you so much. And here are the nominees for Best Collaboration. And the winner is... Decameron Opera Coalition. The most important thing for opera has been in the last couple of years to try and grow our audience and make sure that we get new voices and new people on stage and creators and stories of different kinds, but making sure that also we have people to watch them. This year has been challenging because our usual way of getting people into seats has been difficult. There's no more going to schools and there's no more panel discussions in the same way, but this year has once again persevered and there have been amazing, amazing outreach initiatives. So that being said, here are the nominees for Best Outreach Initiatives. And the award goes to Janae Bridges and LA Opera for Lift Every Voice. I feel like we need a commercial break or some comical relief. So I'm just gonna dance around for about 15 seconds and then we're gonna go on to the next thing. Before we move on, I just want to say three things that you can do in order to support and encourage artists in 2021 to just keep going because they got this. First of all, it is to um, interact with their content, whether it is in a YouTube video or on Instagram or all that kind of stuff. Make sure you're engaging with their content because it really helps. Two, any financial assistance can be incredibly helpful. So if they have a Patreon or you can buy them a cup of coffee or whatever it is, please try and help them out. And number three, share it with a friend. Share it to two friends. Send something that you like of a different artist or of an artist so that they can get a little more exposure. So yes, just two friends. That's all you have to do. Two friends and they send it to two friends. Pay it forward. Have you seen the movie? Yes. A singer's education is priceless. And we singers look for any opportunity that we can to engage with artists of different levels and of different backgrounds so that we can learn more about our craft. This year has been incredible to see how masterclasses have been taking place internationally with people from all different levels. And the nominees for Best Masterclass Series Online are... And the winner is, oh, that was satisfying, Lizette Oropesa. To be honest, it would be really nice for a host right now, someone to, you know, have a little chit chat with. But since this is a new award series and it is done virtually, I guess I will just have to uh, continue on, on my own as I've been doing so far. But with that being said, new things all around. This year's new artist of the year are the following. Here are the nominees. And the award goes to, should you make it satisfying? Oh, that cleaned it right off. That was, ooh, that was nice. Adriana Gonzalez artists that inspire young aspiring new emerging artists like myself to keep going and keep doing what we're doing so thank you to all of you incredible artists but first of all here are the nominees for this category
And the award goes to, oh, damn it, toward the page. Lizette Opesa. Before we end this um, wonderful evening, I would like to say thank you to 360 Opera for hosting this event. I'm Avi Green, and if you would like to check all of my information out, it's here. And I run a podcast, um, AA Opera, which you can check out here, where we do more interviews with amazing people who make opera happen. With that being said, it's time to talk about our favorite moments from 360 of opera. And you've all voted, and your favorite part of 360 of Opera in 2020, was it the pub quiz, was it Maria Monday, was it the merch, or was it... Because I already know the answer. <laughs> the award goes to... Blah, 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 blah. 360 of Opera live interviews. Thank you all very, very much for voting, and I hope you enjoyed this evening. With that... I'm going to go uh, tell Phil that he needs to work harder next time. <laughs>